Hi there, it's Bailey from Glowforge. I've been here at Glowforge since the very beginning, so I've heard every question in the book. And I know the amount of information out there can be overwhelming. So I decided to bring you what I think are the need to know questions and answers for anyone thinking about getting a Glowforge. If that's you, you've come to the right place. And I thought the right place to start would be with our number one most asked question. What kinds of materials can I use with my Glowforge? Well, here's the short answer, all kinds. Seriously, there are hundreds and hundreds of options to choose from. But are you ready for the long answer? Glowforge can do three things. Cut like scissors, score like a pen, and engrave to create depth and shade like carving wood or shading pencils. With some materials like wood and acrylic, your Glowforge can do all three of those things. And others like aluminum, you'll be able to leave a permanent custom engrave. Yes, I personally have engraved a MacBook or two. Your material options are pretty much close to limitless from woods to leathers to stone to chocolate. But there are a few things to keep in mind when selecting materials for your Glowforge. If you wanna go the absolute easiest route, we make a line of materials called Proof Grade. It's a whole line of specially sourced, coated, and lab tested materials for laser cutting and engraving. Every single piece is specially chosen to work perfectly with your Glowforge. We make all different kinds of Proof Grade. Top quality plywoods, heirloom quality hardwoods, vibrant acrylics, paper thin veneer, and vegetable tan leather. We also have an inexpensive prototyping material called Draft Board. Proof grade materials look white because of the special protective coating over the top. This protects your materials from getting any marks on it during the print process, so it'll be pristine right out of the Glowforge. Plus, our premium wood products are all pre-sanded and finished to save you time. And they come with a QR code that your Glowforge can read. The cameras and the lid of your Glowforge scans the code on your proof grade, so your Glowforge automatically identifies it and picks the best settings, which we've tested here at Glowforge HQ. Of course, you can also use your own materials from plywood from the hardware store to a rock you pick up at the river to an old pair of jeans. Just keep in mind that your Glowforge can print on material up to a quarter inch thick and on some material up to a half inch thick with multiple passes. You can also engrave on thicker objects like stainless steel flasks or bamboo cutting boards by removing your crumb tray and setting your object or material in the bottom of your Glowforge. When you're using new materials, it's important to do a bit of research on the best settings for your material before printing with your Glowforge. Here is a cheat code. Contact the material manufacturer to find out if it's laser compatible. If they say, yeah, it sure is, they'll often have specific recommendations since they spend all day thinking about that material. Another great place for advice on materials is the Glowforge Community Forum. On the forum, you'll find posts from hundreds of Glowforge owners who have tried and tested everything from tortoiseshell acrylic to pumpkin pies. When I print on non-proof grade material, I just go to community.glowforge.com and search for the material settings someone else has suggested as a way to get started. And when you add settings to the Glowforge app, you can even bookmark them so that you have easy access for next time. Hopefully that helps you feel more confident about the amazing array of materials you can explore with your Glowforge. If you want to dive even deeper into materials, visit glowforge.com slash discover and check out what others have done with your favorite materials. And I'd love to know, what other questions do you have about Glowforge? Add them in the comments and maybe we'll use them for our next video. Or if you just wanna get your Glowforge questions answered one-on-one, -on -one, click the link below to set up a call with a Glowforge expert. See you soon.